Hi, welcome to Raw Math. Today I'm doing a series of videos on lines and slopes, and this is specifically an application of slope. So it says Jerry was driving home after work, working the night shift. He left at 7 a.m., so time since 7 a.m. Use the graph to find the speed Jerry drove in miles, miles per hour. This is minutes, this is hours, we're gonna have to deal with that. And find a linear function, D of T, for the distance Jerry drives. Okay, so this right here is 0, 0.25. And this is 3, 21 and a half. So slope is y sub two minus y sub one over x sub two minus x sub one, which is going to be 21.5 minus 25 over three minus zero, which is going to be a negative 3.5 over three. And because we never leave a decimal in a fraction, we're gonna say m is equal to, um, I don't want a repeating decimal. I'm gonna cheat, I'm gonna go up, negative seven sixths. Negative just means that the distance between work and home is going down because we're getting closer to home as we go. And the slope is negative seven sixths. We want everything in miles per hour, so what I did was fair versus going to decimal since I'm not using a calculator right now. This is miles per minute. I don't want miles per minute, nobody talks about that. So there are 60 minutes in an hour, so if every minute that's how far he goes, after 60 minutes, he's gonna go 70 miles towards home. So the slope is negative 76, but the speed is 70 miles per hour. It's negative because he's going towards home. The equation, d of t, distance over time, He's starting 25 miles away, and he's taking away 7 sixths of uh, that distance, 7 sixths of a mile, so 1.16 repeat miles every minute. So here's my equation, here's the speed. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel, like my Facebook page, and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks.